welcome to Wednesday's episode of this week of the Gamescast on YouTube.com slash Improv Gaming. Don't, don't tell my about that, eh? You look so sexy. Stop fooling around, Pete. I am your host for this episode, the biggest Zelda fan in the world, Jeremy Bird. I don't believe I have a tattoo of the Triforce on my arm. And the master sword in his pants. I was going to say it, but you guys have to ruin everything. As Nick. you said, the biggest Zelda fan in the world, coming at you once again. I'm joined by my two best friends, my cohorts... This is getting out of hand. <laughs> this is getting out of hand. Uncontrollable. Fucking bullshit. But I'm joined with my two best friends in gaming. First to my right, he is the host of the most, Mr. I'm Wondering Himself, Pete Anderson. Good day. Oh, God. And to my far right, he has the best ponytail in the business. It's all right. Fabulous. Mr. Nicholas. How's it going tonight, everybody? And gentlemen... It has been revealed that coming up at the end of Marvel Civil War, we're going to get a Doctor Strange trailer. How do you like them apples? At well, the end? Exactly. And we're going to get it at the ending. Like, that the second ending is supposed exactly to be Doctor Strange. How we do this. I, We've seen a trailer. Not sure. I'm sorry. We're going to get, the, like, you know, the special endings they do? We're going to get Doctor Strange. scene of Doctor okay. Strange? Yes. Sorry, I said it wrong. But why yeah. did they announce that? They dropped it today. But why? Well, the game... Uh, the, to the hype game. it up. The movie's already been out and reviewed. And I know everything. that. So the, people the, are going to leak it. The, point of post credits is not knowing. to be surprised. Sorry. Well, like now I know. Are you sad that his apples kind of <laughs> yeah, the way you of, taste? And kind of ruined I'm my... out of here. I'm done. <laughs> no, I'm like, done. I'm done. Like, like, I don't know why you. that was announced. <laughs> like, Welcome. Why would somebody <laughs> say that? Why would somebody say, hey, you know that thing you go to Marvel movies for besides the movie, like the second best thing of Marvel movies? I'm gonna ruin that for you. That's like that's like coming out of the theater or going into the theater and the guy coming out goes, "Hey, the end credits is uh, Doctor Strange." And well, like you would punch that guy. No, 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 no. <laughs> that's not as bad. The worst should be coming out of episode eight. Oh yeah, Han Solo dies by the way. No, no, I'm episode talking about seven. the like like what the end seven? credits. Yeah. Sorry, seven. Yeah, well, he could die in eight. They could reincarnate yeah, him. Yeah, right. Why not? <laughs> but like, like that's like that's like. Miso on Solo. What the fuck, bro? You're not supposed to ruin that. That's supposed to be like the surprise. That's supposed to be the Easter egg. <laughs> if you didn't know, this is the greatest video games games cast in all the Mushroom Kingdom, all of Albion, and all the incarnations of the Assassin's Creed universe. Oh, you're really pulling Ooh, off yeah, mixed up. baby. We are three friends who talk about video games every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. We honor you with Let's Plays every Tuesdays and Thursdays, and time, excuse me, and from time to time, we honor you with special live streams. And we also do the biggest news in gaming via the one-up news from Pete Anderson and myself. And, and the big news from... I was going to say, will you not ruin it? I'm on a roll. Stop talking. Yeah, and on Sundays we yeah. do the biggest news <laughs> in gaming lean on, on me. Lean on me. Shh. And when that's, you're not strong. And if that sounds good to you... I'll be your... Ah, oh, you made me... I want to smack him. Thank you. <laughs> and if that sounds you. good to you, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, leave comments, and share our beautiful faces with your no. beautiful friends. And now, on to the topic at hand. I ruined, I ruined the topic at hand, I think. That was actually a really good <laughs> Nick way. I'll take that. But Easter eggs. There's, t- there's countless Easter eggs. I'm going to start with one of my favorites because... Legend of Zelda. No, I was talking about Batman Arkham. I'll talk about another one. My absolute favorite had to be in Arkham Asylum. I'm messing around in Quincy (coughs) Sharp's office. Bless you. I'm sorry. Thank you. And basically, it was after the game was done. I'm just futzing around with it, and I was just trying to get rid of the last Joker teeth. I threw a batarang. It missed, and you know when it hits a regular wall, it just bounces off the wall, whatever? It got stuck, and I'm like, what the fuck? And I go up, and you know you can check walls. You just go... I'm like, it's hollow. I punch it through, I walk through, and there's the big map of Arkham City. Oh, nice. You guys didn't know about that? Yeah, yeah, I know about yeah, that. Yeah, no, literally, I, just, I didn't know about it at the time because I wasn't using the internet to find out all the secrets, but I was like, I was like, what the hell? I'm like, Arkham City, oh. I was like, this is awesome, but I'm a little terrified at the same time. Nice little Easter egg by the developers. Nice, nice. Because we never knew we were going to get a sequel at the time. No one, no one else knows other Easter eggs? My favorite Easter egg <laughs> is a couple. I like when things get homaged. Point in case, Quantum Break, Alan Wake. Did you do this in the beginning with the TV? Yeah. And seeing Alan Wake as a little Easter egg to be like, oh, I remember you huh. way back when. 
Then there's another one, and I believe it's in Ocarina of Time 3DS. Which one is there, that? There's a picture in the oh, that's house. Cool. In the castle? That's been, that was in the original. Oh. No, wait, 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 no, 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 what, what, that was an Easter egg. Were you talking about when you walk in the courtyard of Zelda, or were you talking about? No, in the, when you first wake up, there's like a picture of something, or is that a Majora's Mask? Somewhere in Legend of Zelda, there's something that's in, an Easter egg. In, in somewhere. Link to the Past, there's a picture of Mario on one of the houses on the wall. Um, that could probably be it. There's one, I know which... Yes, uh, that's the one I'm exactly talking about. No, I, an Easter egg I know it. No, no, there is one. I know which one you're talking about. It's in Majora's Mask or Ocarina of Time. I forget what the picture is of, but it has some significance down the road in the series. <clears throat> Let us know, fans, in the comments. I have one, and be prepared to be like, "Oh, of course, Nick brings this up." Okay, are you ready? <laughs> okay, okay, hold on. It can either be Metal Gear Solid. It <laughs> can Gear either Solid. be Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Destiny. Destiny. He never played Destiny. He doesn't know. <laughs> or it could be Deadpool? just something random that we're going to punch him in the face. <laughs> Continue. So you were right on the first one. It's Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> so Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Solid 2, and Metal Gear Solid 4. There's one recurring Easter egg in all three of them. Isn't it like the Japanese one? No. In the first one, you're going through the ventilation system. And instead of going to where the DARPA chief is, if you keep on going down further, you'll get into the bathrooms that are across the hall, and there's a guy taking a shit in the bathroom, and he's, like, blowing it up. Yeah. And he's, like, dying, right? And Metal Gear Solid 2 is riding, and when you're looking for the president by way of his pacemaker, so you're looking, you're using the, the microphone, yeah. if you point it in the back corner of the room, you hear the same guy taking a shit, complaining about how this shit is worse than the one in <laughs> <laughs> that he took I during about Shadow that Moses, right? And then Metal Gear Solid 4, Meryl starts dating the guy that keeps on shitting his pants who happens to be the same guy from those two. That's great. That's great. I, I knew about the second. I didn't know about the third one. I forgot about that. The third one, yeah. It's Metal Gear Solid 4 where Meryl, like the, the guy in Meryl's squad, he keeps on shitting himself. Like whenever he gets into a tight situation, he shits himself and the crew is just like, oh my God, really? He did it fucking again. And yeah, that, Meryl, you point he, your gun at him and yeah, they're like, really? He did ends again? up being the guy that, that, that was in the last two where he was shitting in the bathroom and he was shitting in the, and well, both of them were bathroom scenes, but. Oh, wait, I forgot about that one. No. Indulge me here, because I'm I think this is a stretch for an Easter egg, but I feel like it can be. Wolfenstein the New Order. You yeah. play the game. Uh, there's certain points where you have like this nightmare, and what the nightmare is is you go back to the original Wolfenstein 3D. Would you consider that an Easter egg? Because it's the original one. That's cool. I like yeah, that. why not? Okay. I'm not an Easter egg. I don't That's go. Nice. Out, I don't go really out of my way unless it's smacking me in the face yeah. saying, hey, you know. I don't remember if it's Halo Reach or Halo ODST or which which one it is. I, I don't remember exactly, but there's a poster in one of them where you see a picture of Earth and like right next to like the brim of Earth, you see a white dot and it says Destiny is coming. That's cool. I actually have an Easter egg. It's been replaced ever since then. Oh, but yeah. ever since Bungie like lost the rights to 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 Halo, like they Microsoft replaced that specific spot. That's cool. More Halo is coming. Uh, Easter egg. I actually have one. Is in Ratchet and Clank the new one? All the Insomniac games. They point to it. Uh, I forget what it, the first thing is, but it's like it's Resistance Fall of Man, but it's like. Oh, check out the new game, blah blah blah, Fall of Blarg. Oh, okay. So like you. they do little like yeah, tidbits little, little to like the like Insomniac games, which I yeah I you know there's a lot of Easter eggs. I feel it's just one of my favorite had to be um, I think it was Super Mario 3D World. It was the year of Luigi. They literally stuck a eight bit Luigi like like a little picture of him somewhere in every single stage. I've actually seen um, a YouTube channel go through the game and be like, and do, here's all the Easter eggs for Super Mario 3D World, and literally he shows where every single Luigi is. Nice. I would, I think it's a cool Easter egg, but I'm like, wow, that's, that's, like, some of them are just so obscure, it's like you can see them if you're falling off a platform and you're about to die, I'm like, that's kind of <laughs> lame. Like, really? What's, what's, uh, there was another one I was thinking of. I can't remember what it was. Shit. 
I thought it was a pretty good one. Uh, Shit. Oh, oh, Metal Gear. Yeah, actually, thank you. It's Metal Gear, the first one. When you're in the fight with uh, Psycho Mantis, all the posters or all the all the frames on the on the entire wall are all the developers and the there's Hideo Kojima. Oh and, yeah. yeah. All the and they're they're like moving around. They're like whacking big, at you yeah. and stuff. That's pretty good. I like that. I really have to play the original. You should. I should. It's good. Maybe soon. Maybe. Mm-hmm. You're trying to peep way into something? No. I can never tell. <laughs> I told you, Easter eggs are not my forte. Um, I, I do enjoy, when I catch them, I love them. Oh, excuse me, gentlemen. I'm sorry. Quantum Break okay. with Alan Wake. Ratchet and Clank with Fall of Blarg and others. Yeah. But I don't go out of my way. I think it's cool. I, same here. I just look for them and just... Uh... But if I catch them, it's cool. But I'm not. it's not something that it's going to be like, ooh, let me check every little nook and cranny to see if something's up. But You know, I, like if I find them... Like, originally the... Um, what was it? Yoshi and Super Mario 64. That was supposed to be an Easter egg. Yeah. But, like, everybody found out about it after a while. But... You are right? I don't know. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Don't drop. We don't need puke on the channel. Blah! Welcome to improv puking. Ugh. There's just countless Easter eggs out there and I can't think of any right now. This is kind of embarrassing. Yeah, right? I just... Easter eggs. Um... The only, every time we talk about Easter eggs, you know what I think about on a sidebar? Easter? Is... No, besides that. Is <laughs> Banjo-Kazooie. And Banjo... Or Kazooie. I think it's Kazooie. Farting out the eggs out of his ass. Oh. Remember the eggs you can collect? Yeah. And you just go, and it comes out of the ass, or you could shoot through the mouth, but nobody ever did that. They always shot with the ass. There yeah. was an Easter egg in Banjo Kazooie, now you mentioned. I'm trying to remember which one it was. It was probably for Conker, right? Weren't they? Yeah, yeah if you look at the bar in uh, Conker's Bad Fur Day, you see a picture of Banjo on the wall. <laughs> nice. There, it's I miss it's that homages game. to different games, yeah, which is cool. It usually is. I mean, in, I think it's. I think it's Witcher, actually, if I'm right. Um, <gasps> I know an Easter egg. Thank you. I think it's Witcher. If I'm right, it, it, it's, it might be Witcher, where there's an alley somewhere. I don't remember where it is. But you see a haystack and a dead body next to the haystack. And the dead body is dressed in a hood, a white hood with a red scarf around his waist. <laughs> And it's basically making fun of like That's if, you jump, if you forensic. jump into a haystack, chances are you're gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> I give remember one, and this was a very big Easter egg when it came out. Uncharted Day's Deception, Which in one the was that? pub, the third one. Okay. The th- um, the pub scene, the very beginning of the game. If you go over to the bar and go to the newspaper, it shows there's an academic coming, and it's basically a tease for The Last of Us. Oh, okay. So it was cool because everybody saw that and go, what is this? And it was basically leaked that, oh, they're working on something post-apocalyptic did Naughty Dog. Which was cool because, like, if you if you went, like, it, that's one thing where I would have easily overlooked it, you know? And I did the first time. But actually going back and replaying it, I actually, this time, went for the remastered and actually looked and said, oh, this was the big thing. That everybody was talking about. I feel I would hit a lot more Easter eggs if I replayed the game. But there's so many games that come out, yeah. I can't replay all of them. I wanted to replay Quantum Break, but then Ratchet and Clank happened. <laughs> and then Ratchet and Clank's gonna end, and Uncharted's gonna come. And after Uncharted, it's gonna be Doom. And then I'm just gonna be going crazy. I still need to get back to my backlog. Yeah. Oh, that dreaded backlog. <laughs> that was, a, oh, great, was, that gonna, was a great topic. I was gonna bring you uh, Evil with him, but I forgot it. Why? Because yeah, it's just yeah. gonna—it's gonna sit there. Yeah, yeah. Like my GameCube, right? Yeah, it's, I really need to get back to GameCube. Check out on the channel. Uh, re- regrettable backlogs. I think that's how you put it. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Regrettable backlogs. A couple weeks back. Quite, quite a fun little topic. Any other back. Easter eggs? No, not that I can think of come to mind. But what Easter eggs do you guys remember? Which oh, one? Grand Theft Auto. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Grand Theft Auto. Um, they have uh, the pear brand, or fruit brand, I fruit. The phones are all iFruit. Yeah. Which is oh, yeah, yeah. iPods yeah. and iPhones and has the little, like, pear on the back. That's instead what... Of, instead of the Apple. They had a... When I was babysitting back in the day, yes, people trusted me with their children. <laughs> I watched iCarly. Uh-huh. And they had the iPair. Yes. That's pear phone. You know. <laughs> that does nothing to do with gaming. And it probably makes me... You just me saw that through the correlation. But I yeah. thought of that because I was like, you know... Nice. 
Easter yeah. eggs, even in TV shows. Yep. Fun stories. But what Easter eggs were your favorites? Which ones did you find out? What are we week? missing? Because we know we're missing. Oh, yeah. yeah, we're missing tons of Easter shit, eggs. Shit I mean, happened. I mean, what, 20 years of gaming? You think we got all of them? 30 That's years. A, psyops to Mind Gate Conspiracy. They're Easter egg. <laughs> psyops too. It was the wrong Easter egg. <laughs> yeah, but which ones are your favorite? Which ones did you find on your own? Or did you look up on the internet to find out? Let us know in the comments below. And what do we got coming up on Friday? Um... We're going to get rewarded for our efforts. Yeah, yeah, I can't wait. Rewards Rewards coming. We're going to talk about rewards. Shut up, Pete. Shut up. (laughs) I I have an awesome Captain Hook. Disney Captain Hook. What does it say on the bottom? It's actually a funny story. What does it say on the (laughs) bottom? (laughs) The thing is, lie, me, never. The truth is far too much fun. Which is one of my favorite things I like to say. Oh, okay. And it's funny because, for fans who know, my favorite movie is Hook. And Captain Hook in Hook actually says it. It's not the Disney version. But I wanted a Disney Captain Hook. And I said, well, you know, what the fuck? Nobody's going to know. So I wrote, lie me, ha, 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 never. The truth is far too much fun. It's in the classroom scene. Sorry. I'm getting late. Have you ever seen Hook? Of course I've seen Hook. Who hasn't seen Hook? Good. We would, I would have glued you off the channel. Back Who hasn't there. seen Hook? It's a great movie. Yeah, but it's the best should... movie, and you should see it. If if you take anything from this episode, ladies and gentlemen, you will go home. You will go on Netflix. You will go on Hulu. Trust me, I have them all queued up. Shut up. I also have. If you take anything from this episode, understand that there are Easter eggs in video games, and they're fun, and none of them have to do with Hook. I'm pretty sure. And then <laughs> there's a Blu-ray of Hook I have. There's a DVD. And on that note, actually two on DVDs. Friday, <laughs> we will see you guys then. And as usual, game on. And no one wants to see your gut, Pete. Did I show my gut? Yeah, you did. Oh, people love to see it. <laughs> I would go to the south side.